All right, so you didn't have to kill yourself to get small. You already know where you need to be. You just want to no. get in shape and stuff. Not at all. Okay. So how was that having Mickey Bay there with you? That's my boy. <laughs> oh, it's great because first and foremost, he didn't did it, you know? So mm -hmm. just to have that championship pedigree in your corner yep. is like a win-win situation for me. Absolutely. Yeah, he was a champ at 135, and he's a good person too. So oh, Yeah, for sure. I think that's the perfect person to have in your corner. No doubt. So the car, it'd be nice right there in Vegas. That's nice. That's where you're living at now. So Yeah. It's gonna be <laughs> you big. know it's going to be a big turnout. Devin fight with Naras. What do you think about that fight? I think it's a good fight. I do too. You know, I think it's a good fight for him and that he's going to come in and do his job. To me, I think the Naras, I give him a good fight, but the youth would take over. Mm -hmm. You know, and this be his first time to just showcase his talent. Mm -hmm. You know, on a good quality opponent. That's what I said too. I think it's a good name. Well, for he, his, yeah, his name. For some good people. Out. Yep. Yeah, yeah. For his name, it's a real good name. He fought Loma. He dropped Loma. Yes. So, sure. I think that um, I think Devin can stop him though. You know, he's young. He's sharp. Mm -hmm. I think he can get the late stoppage against him. Yeah. Absolutely. I saw um, Gamboa was supposed to fight a little B Hop. What you think about that fight? <laughs> I think B Hop will get him. B Hop got a lot of skill. Yeah. He real skillful. And I think uh, Gamboa is over the top to me. That's just my opinion. Mm -hmm. I agree. But he's becoming the, um, what's it called? He's the gatekeeper. The gatekeeper. All of, yes, for gatekeeper. all the young up and coming. Like, they <laughs> yeah, all know. He's the sick of my mouth. Yeah. Damn, a little beehive, like, who next, Shakur? So, yeah. you know, they all fighting him. But um, it's, it, I like, it's I like name that name. Like I said, it's a good name on the resume. Oh, yeah. Because oh, yeah. I don't know if you remember at one time, Gamboa was the man, especially at 126. No, for sure. Nobody uh, no. really fight him. Absolutely. He was undefeated. He was fast. But mm -hmm. so it's definitely a good name. Let's see what they, ask. they don't have any questions for us. They they just looking. You, you, know, I'm on my, you know I'm on my second page. They be hating on my main page. That's some bullshit. Uh, so. <laughs> we gotta go on the main way. I know. <laughs> how long how much longer? I don't know. It'd be three weeks on Monday. Did you even try? It? I tonight. Yeah. You tried it. I tried no. last night. I tried tonight. I've been sending them stuff. They don't respond back to me. They're like, no, like, just wait. I think three weeks on Monday. So I'm convinced. They just hating on you a little bit. Listen, somebody went and complained about a post from January 2021. Like, I don't even remember posting it. And they, they told and they removed it and, you know, shut me down. So What was it about? I think it was some white girl that was trying to jump these black, these two sisters. And they wound up trying to tase them. And they wound up taking the tase and beating up. So somebody oh, reported man. that. And, um, you know how they do. If it was the other way around, I guarantee they wouldn't have removed it. <laughs> for sure okay so somebody said who do you want to fight Brody <laughs> I want to fight whoever to be honest I, I just love fighting so you know my job is just going there and, and fight you know so I, anybody I, for real who so who's some, some, who's some of the champions at 122 I know we got my boy um Scooter who's else, who you else know. at 122 he, he from your way you know so. that's my guy you know that's my guy so. know. <laughs> it's going to be good too it's going to be big yeah. So you got Scooter, you got Figueroa, and then the guy oh, MJ. Oh wait, Brandon's brother? Yeah. Omar's no, brother. Brandon. No. Okay. Brandon. Yeah, Omar's brother, Brandon. Yeah. He got one loss, right? Didn't he lose? No, he didn't lose. He's still undefeated. Yeah. Okay. I didn't know he was at one twenty-two. Yeah, he at twenty-two. He got the okay. W. He got the WBA. Nice. Yeah. Okay. What about the other one? I think his name start with an N. MJ. Yeah. Okay. So he's um. The guy from uh, Uzbekistan. Okay. So you just want to fight whoever? Yeah, whoever. <laughs> just be patient and knowing that my time going to come. That's what I was going to ask you. So do you like like the pace is moving at right now? For sure. Okay. You're just taking your time. It said, what I, round I, do you think Haney's going to drop Linares? Hopefully the first. <laughs> I know, right? Get it out the way? <laughs> yeah, no doubt. <laughs> Absolutely. Beat Vasquez. It's a Vasquez at 122? I don't see. I don't know a lot of them at 122. I think he was at 18. He was at 18. Okay. I don't remember him moving up. Okay. But I don't yeah, who that is. If you want to fight, we could do it. Who, whoever. <laughs> and you signed to Devin Haney's promotion company, right? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. So, of course, you love how they move you. I mean, that's, that's a good thing to be signed with him. His company is kind of, it's, it's, it's getting big, though. But it's getting it's getting big. Yeah, it's getting big. And, and the good thing is he's promoting at least part of the promoter of his own fights. 
So you're yeah. getting paid twice. Listen, I'm all about making your money. Mm -hmm. And he young, young, rich, rich and flashy. He remind me of young Floyd. Yeah, he do. <laughs> Absolutely. Let me see what else they're asking up here. So what you been doing since um the third, since you've been back in Vegas? When did you come back to Vegas? Like that Sunday? I got back Monday. And when you hit the gym again? That next morning, Sunday. That next morning? Wow. Yeah. I just ran like five miles. After winning <laughs> your fight the night before? Yeah. That's dedication. No, for sure. Because I feel like, like you know, the average person right after they fight, right? So they take a night, oh, at least a week, two, maybe three, maybe a month off. Mm -hmm. I just feel like once you're done fighting, that you should just at least train a couple days that next week. You know, so it don't be as bad because when you think about it, when you're not training and then you've been on a strict diet for so long and then turn around and just start eating whatever, then all that food and stuff just sit on you, you know? So I so feel you a lot fight, better. You so you, you don't have a feast after you fight. You don't just go crazy eating a whole bunch of stuff. Nice. And you got to be mindful that your stomach shrunk, you know? Mm-hmm. What's about getting everything back in tune together? Absolutely. Was your mom and dad at the fight? Yeah, my whole yeah. family. Oh time. really? Right, yes. Well, everybody out. <laughs> I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see this video, the link to just give you like a. It's basically Please. like a little lead up into the fight, it's just so you can see how it was. A lot of people came up. Oh, I'm so, so mad. I missed it. I, oh, I really wanted to come, but it's okay. I'll, I'll be out. there in May. Shout out, Prosperous. Who? Prosperous Perk. What up, Prosperous? Oh, right there, <laughs> true champion. He from yeah, Vegas. Shout out, yeah. Uh -huh. Nice. Does he fight? No, nah, he doesn't fight. Oh, okay. He, he a super manager. Nice. All right, no, regular, he's super. Just say, just say super manager. Respect. James Menace said, what weight are you going to max out at? Like, what do you feel your your body going at the highest? Probably 135. Okay. Maybe 130. And how old are you? 23. Oh, you're young. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. you got a few weight classes to move up. 130, yeah. 135. Is, how tall are you? What, a 5'8", five, 5'9"? Five, five, five and a half. Oh, you, oh I'm five, five, so you like my height. <laughs> five, 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 six on a good day. Depends on what shoes. <laughs> <laughs> so can you ever get like five, seven? Not, not, not at all? <laughs> nah. <laughs> but that's a good size for the weight class that you're in. That's usually like. Yeah, not for sure, yeah. That's how tall they are. And mm -hmm. How does it feel to come from Cali all the way over to Atlanta? So how was that coming from the west side over there and selling it out? I come from uh, Vegas, actually. Mm -hmm. Vegas. It was, good. Mm -hmm. it was good, you know, just by me being active and getting back in the ring. I was literally, I was surprised that when I came out, how many people it was, because once I went in, it wasn't that many people. You know, we get there. Everybody late. was just saying that they were just waiting on me. So yeah, you know, we I be came out, I looked, I was like, <laughs> oh, and it's like, I just rise to the occasion. Like, I love it. So you like the feel of a pack house so you yes. can perform. Yeah. I, I believe that you... You uh, look good, you fight good. Right. You feel good, for sure. Absolutely. And everybody, everybody was there. That's, so I'm sure everybody going to be there in Vegas in May. Oh, yeah, yeah. And it was, it was celebrities. It was, you know. Celebrities athletes. there? Yeah. Oh, okay. Football players, basketball players. Oh, so you showed out. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. You know, everybody in Atlanta, so. That's no, I right. Just had, I just had to make a couple calls. Yeah, yeah. Atlanta, Atlanta be forgetting about COVID too. They be COVID where? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they be yeah. Atlanta be Atlanta be lit. Though. my people live down there. My friend, she been down there since like ninety nine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Atlanta is definitely lit. So you had some ball players there watching you work. Yeah, they can always come to my fights. Yeah. Okay, and I, and I think Vegas be even bigger. You no, know, Vegas is I Vegas. Think so, yeah, for sure. Everybody so, thought to get away at least for a good weekend. And it's Memorial Day weekend, too. It is? Yeah. Oh, it's really going to be nice. Yeah, I'll, I'll be there. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. When is Memorial Day weekend? 29. You, you got to come by yourself, though, too. You can't be bringing. I, I always be, come by myself. Or you can't be bringing Cool Boy and all that. You know, I understand uh, y'all for the same <laughs> city, but hey. <laughs> no, I'm going to come by myself. That's my guy, though. Uh, you know what it is? I've been watching him since he was young when I started going to Philly in like 2014. So I, I watched the progress of him becoming the world champion. So I'm I'm proud of him. No, for sure. That's like he 
He works hard. Yeah, he shot. Let me tell you he, something. He just gotta keep winning. You know what I'm That's saying? right. So he he shot the beat. shit out of me. How he beat him though? I knew he could box, but I didn't know he was gonna fight him like that. So he mm -hmm. like he fought for it. So, you know, I'm, I'm proud of him. Yeah, no, for sure. They got any Eric. young black man getting the belt? No, no doubt, for sure. So hopefully you next. Worst. No, <laughs> for sure. But that guy who who he beat wanted me to work with him for a cool boy style. Oh, word to get yeah. you re get him ready. You said no, no, there you go. No. <laughs> Uh, I'd rather fight him. Yeah. If he came down to it, like, nah, you can't do that. But I, I knew that he would beat him anyway. I, I knew too, but I, I, he shocked me beating him like that. Like, he was fighting mm -hmm. him. Yeah. So, you know, I'm proud of y'all young black men winning these titles. Appreciate keep, you. Look, keep, keep bobbing the bank, keep getting paid. Please. That's the only way. <laughs> For real. And that's that's what it's about making your money and getting out of the sport. Mm -hmm. So you can retire. So I see the tank might be fighting. Uh, what's his name? Barrios at one forty. What you think about that fight? I like that fight for tank. What you think? He gonna clip him. Yeah, he is. He he's too straight up and down. Uh huh. Oh look, at Lorenzo. He on here. What up? Man, that's my brother for real. I'm trying to get him on my live too. What up, Lorenzo? No, I talked to him. He like a bougie. Yeah, man. I didn't reach out to him multiple times. That's all good though. You know, like, we give him a pass. He's getting ready for his fight. We, we yeah. ain't gonna give him like that. He I, ready for I, I understand. What pass. boxer does your style compare to? That's what James asked you. I look at a lot of different fighters and then I just take some from like each of them and just put it into my own game. Nice. So I would have to say, I mean, I can't really say just one specific person. I watch a lot of different people. I was about to ask you who you watched most, like um, growing up and stuff that you enjoyed to watch. The one you love the most? Oh, I mean, come on. <laughs> That's my man. <laughs> yeah, I already know. Yeah, I know how I feel about Floyd. So. Uh -huh. I mean, I, every like young guy I've had on here told me that it's Floyd is who they watch the most. I mean, that man, he, he by, by lot. You know, he he can fight any style, whether it's a brawler, boxer, whatever. He always make it look so easy. I like I like Pernell Whitaker, too. Me, too. Uh, who else? Mm. Me, too. Yeah. Sweet Pea, was, uh, it was his defense. No, nah, for sure. Uh, that's why he beat the hell out of Chavez and they robbed him. But, you know, it's all good, though. You know how that go. You know, to me, I feel like to this day, that's probably the biggest robbery in history. He won no rounds in that fight. Not a single round. I've watched that fight multiple times, and he beat the hell out of him. Like, he dominated him. Yeah. So. Thoughts he, had, so he said he didn't see. I, like I, I got you, Lorenzo. After the fight, we, we, we going. I like Earl. I want to continue to keep winning and doing his thing. Me too. But You think that fight with T-Boy ever going to happen? I don't think so, but... Uh, I'm biased, so I'm always go for Crawford. But I just, you know, I'm gonna go for both. I, well, I can't pick no winner when they fight, but I kind of yeah. don't want to see it. I know somebody gonna have to lose, but I like Crawford. You like Crawford? Okay. Yeah. I had Chavez winning one round. That's a gift round because you can't. What round? That's a gift. <laughs> Let's see. Who's Eddie Kane? That's your boy. Yeah, that's my boy. He from Vegas too. Right, yeah. No, nah, he's from Philly, actually. He's from Philly. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, Philly, My neighborhood. he lives out here in Vegas. Okay. Nice. That's cr I can get him on the live. I can't get him to call my phone. It's all good, though. You see Eddie Kane? Eddie Kane Jr. <laughs> you know what movie that was? Um, the Five Heartbeats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's before your time. I'm sorry. Before your time. Who's the best 130-pounder right now? Um... I'm going with Shakur. I'm not going to name Tank. Yeah. To me, Tank is like moving up. So 130. I think he's a 35 pounder. Yeah, exactly. I, so. I agree with Shakur, too. Yeah, I'm going to go with Shakur. He's different. Yeah, he is. When I was out there in Houston, I got some videos of him. Even just to look at him, like it's the way he moves, the way he throws punches. Is he always out of range? Like you can't hit him? Yeah, his ability to think. Well, his yeah. IQ is like on a thousand. Yeah, it's the way he control the distance. Either he's too close, he's too far. You can't hit him. Yeah. Canelo, um, Benavidez. I got Canelo. Who you I got? like Canelo too. I I'm, I love Canelo, so I'm Me always too. be kind of biased. I like Benavidez too, but I think Canelo will stop him. It's I, I I saw some flaws in him that I think Canelo will be able to um take advantage of. I think he'll stop he, him. 
Yeah, he take a lot of punches. Yeah, he don't really care about getting hit. Yep, and that's the wrong person. But to get hit he always him. give it out though. That he of course. But you gotta remember, Canelo could take it. He, yeah. he listen. He proved that to me in that Triple G fight. He tough as shit. No, so, for sure. I've never seen him hurt. Mm -hmm. I think that um he wanted to stop at him. Uh, that's my brother right there from Cali. He said he agreed with the young Thundercat Crawford. What up, bro? That's my big brother. He live in California. <laughs> Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Let's see. But gets hit too much. Yeah, I think so too. They said DC three versus Shakur would be crazy. <laughs> in due time. In due time, yeah. They're not in the same yeah. weight class right now. And uh, I hate two weight classes, baby. Yeah, Shakur is young, so he'll probably be at one thirty five before it's all over. Maybe one forty. Yeah, he's. I mean, I don't know if you saw the videos I posted the other day. He's like big. Yeah, he is. He's, he's yeah. feeling his man strength now, so mm -hmm. they probably be moving up. Thoughts on Devin Haney? I mean, that's his, you know, his boy. I can't even see that. that you can't see him? I can't see that comment. Yeah, he said thoughts on Devin Haney. What you think about about Dev? Solid. Uh, well rounded season fighter. He's sharp as fuck, man. He's mm -hmm. sharp. Like sharp, sharp. I think that he's gonna sell out that. Um, oh fight. yeah, sure. Because it's, to me, it's the biggest name. It's a nice step up for him. I think it's gonna be a big coming out fight. Definitely for him. gonna be a big fight. Yeah. Arrow stops Crawford. Oh wow! Come on, what the hell? Are you tripping? That's like the third person that said Crawford is chinny. I don't know where they get that from though. Who? You never seen Earl really get hit either. Yeah, I mean, he's not... I mean, well, Sean Porter did, but that was a real good fight. That was, that fight was really close. Yeah. I think that Porter made it look close because of his aggressive his style. Eyes. Yeah. But I feel it had, like, Arrow, like, really let go. He probably would have stopped him because the way he always coming, like, forward. Yeah, he come in head first. Head first. I think him and Crawford might be next. What you think about that fight? Mm, I like to like Crawford, so... <laughs> I think he's one of the best fighters in the world. He is. He's my top. Him and um, Errol Spence are my two number ones. Yeah. So, did you fight um, Devin in the? Wait, didn't you fight? You fought Shakur in the amateurs? Yeah, I fought Shakur. We fought in the JL finals. Yeah. Really? Wait. Yeah. We was a hundred and twelve. Oh One fourteen. Always hundred fourteen. Really? How long ago was that? How many years ago? Twenty twelve. Oh wow! I didn't know yeah. that. Okay. How was that experience with him? I mean, he was young, so that fight was boring. <laughs> it was, yeah, it was too boring. Chess match, nobody <laughs> just tried to box, like it was super boring. But we ran through like all the other guys throughout the tournament, but that fight was just super boring. Nice. It was real technical, line. nobody so, really got hurt like that or nothing like that. So, tomorrow night, we got Ennis versus Lippinets Showtime. Mm. What, what, what you think? I, I know what I think. What you think about that fight? I like I like Jerron a lot. I like Jerron a lot. I don't know how much Lippin yet still have left. That's the big question. Yeah. What about that answer? How you like that answer? That's a great answer. He's never been stopped, but he's gonna be stopped on Saturday. Because it's the way he comes forward with that. I want him to. Face first. To. He's gonna listen. Sure. He's gonna kill him. My brother said, Do you have a fight coming up and what is your ultimate goal? I can't even see it. You can't see it? I can't see no comments. There you go. So, what's your ultimate goal? We're waiting on the yeah. opponent come May 29th in Vegas on the Haney Lenars undercard. My ultimate goal is to become, you know, first and foremost world champion, but undisputed world champion in multi divisions. Nice. I like that goal. Yeah, for sure. Jerron well, stopped him in the third. I don't think he going to. I want him I to stop him. I think Lippin yet so tough, he might take him the distance. I think he's going to stop him, but I think it's going to be like five or six because, you know, he's going to be tough. He's going to come out and, you know, be Unless he just get hit with too many punches yeah, too early. Yeah, break him down. Yeah. yeah. Boots is different, man. I, I, listen, I was in camp this last camp watching him. He. Thank you. Appreciate it. He's different. For real. Good luck, DC. Yeah, mid to late round stoppage. I say five or six. Yeah, he gonna stop him. That fight not going. Or, and then you know I'm I'm for the youth. You know, mm -hmm. like 
like we come we all coming so I want them to come over and take over. Mhm. Mm he will. And I tell you this, if you give it some more time, he gonna be a danger to. I think he's a danger to anybody right now, but he really gonna be a danger to anybody at one forty seven. You know, yeah. give us. I'm telling you, just any, gotta anybody. Change. Just fight the right fights. Time That's it. everything. That's it. And I, I and I don't really say Arrow and Crawford because to me they're on a different era. They're kind of on their way. Like yeah, they kind of on their way fight, out. So yeah, exactly. But like so. I, I, I would have liked to see him fight like a Delorme right now, and then yeah, I want that too. And mm -hmm. then maybe uh, um, Josecito Lopez. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, he do. Oh, I didn't know that. And then yeah. after him, somebody like a a, a what's the guy name? Victor Ortiz. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah, yeah. One of them guys. Yeah, but I, I don't really, like you said, I don't put them together because they're not in the same, you know what I mean? They, they're on yeah. their way out the door. They're going to do their thing and probably, I see Errol Smith moving up and I see Crawford getting a really nice payday and probably retiring, so I don't see him staying any long. He probably wow. more like Crawford, you know? Yeah. Not Crawford, like um, Ward. He's going to make his money and get out of it. He said he's going to put his money on Spence. <laughs> It's all opinionated. <laughs> yeah. I, I can't, like I said, I can't pick a winner with them two. Um, I think it'd be a great fight. I would want to It could either them. be a great fight or a boring fight, depending on how they, you know, how they test each other's yeah. power or the chin. It depends on what they do. So The fight would be so built up, I think they're going to just be fighting from the start. Well, then that's even better. Like a Hagler and Hearns? Something like it, for real. Because I know Crawford, <laughs> he not bagging down. Word. He reminds me of Hagler, though. It's his toughness, the way he can switch when he punch. It's, mm -hmm. it's everything. He got a lot of dog in him. So, Or it could be a dud like um, Danny Garcia and Keith Thurman was. I was there. That fight, that fight was boring as hell. No, they were still fighting, though. You it know why I was boring? I think they hurt each other early. So it was kind of like a, you know. It was on cruise control a little bit. A little bit. I was there. I was at the Barclays Center. They was booing him and everything. <laughs> Caleb versus Canelo. I'm going with Canelo. Yeah, I'm going with Canelo. I'm going with Canelo. I like Plant, though. Yeah. But I think that, um, I think that Canelo will be... I don't see nobody beating Canelo right now. Mm -mm. He already yeah. took it. The, the best loss he had was the best thing that ever happened to him. Best thing ever happened to him. Cause I feel like he knew he could never look back for real. Yeah. Took took a lot of Floyd stuff, and he, he do it now in his own fights. So. Yeah. We will never see Hadley versus Hearns again. I know, brother. I know. That was that was special. I think it's the best three rounds I've ever seen in boxing. Mm -hmm. So, what is your favorite venue you would like to fight at? MGM, Barclays, Center, or wherever? Yeah, I never fought at the MGM yet. I fought at the Garden. That was big. Wait, in New York? Mm-hmm. When you fought there? I didn't know that. He When he fought. Abdullah, he was main event. Oh, nice! You the, yeah, I like the fights at the Garden. Yeah, I, was I used not, to go to all of those. <laughs> yeah, I like, I like the Garden uh, fights. Oh so yeah, next would be Vegas, the MGM, and then New York, the Barclays. But I, are they still doing boxing at the Barclays? I thought they stopped doing that. I'm not even sure. I haven't I heard they, that they stopped. Yeah, I thought they did. Boo Boo will definitely beat Canelo. I'll be rooting for Boo Boo, but I don't know. I, I don't know. The best nine minutes in sports. You're right. Absolutely. Truck versus Charlo. Which Charlo? Where Truck fight at? 154? Oh, he, oh yeah. I think he do fight at 54. So probably Jamel. So who you got winning that fight? Which one is Jamel? The one that's just the smaller one. The one at Fort Harrison. Oh, I like I like him. I like, I like Charlo, the other one better. I, I like, the, like yeah, I mean, yeah, I like the big one. I like the big one. Hey, I like, I like Tony. him. <laughs> Tony did good that fight. He really did good. He made me mad by the last fight, the second fight. Like all he had to do was move. But listen, DC, that's every knockout he has has come that way. He be winning the fight and then he get caught <laughs> against he Heard, against Willie Nelson, and then yeah. against um Harrison. This dude could really box. Yeah, he can box, but it's so sad when the chin don't hold him. I get so mad, like you got it all. But for real, he was. If that's, he your, was if that's your Achilles heel. That's a bad one to have. He was dictating the whole fight with his. The whole jab. fight, he was winning every round. Body, then he got, yeah. yeah, 
But it was the same thing against Swift and Willie Nelson. He was running every round. And then he got caught. Mm -hmm. And got stopped. You know what? I'll crush you. Okay, I'm about to hide this from him. I don't do comments like that on here. So, 2021, what can we expect to see from DC? You can expect to see me fight at least three to four more times before the year out. You know, a lot. Come, yeah, like 17, 18 and 0, and then wow. get ready for a big 2022. Nice. Okay. Yeah. So hopefully get to 18 and 0 by the end of this year, and then maybe next year be in title contention. Oh, for sure. As long as you ain't fighting, my boy. Uh, <laughs> But what's crazy, he, he told me, he was like, what about time you get up there? I'll probably been to move up and win. Yeah. yeah. You saw, you see how fat school is right now? He ain't saying that no 122. <laughs> yeah, I see he, he didn't open up that restaurant. It seemed like he eat there every day. Hello? I said, damn, Scooter, what you eating? Yeah, so he'll probably be at 126 and stuff before it's all over with. Yeah. So I look right, forward I, to 2021. I, I got... Yeah, I got to get out there one day, you know, and go go eat at the little crab spot. When are you East coming East. to the East Coast? Oh no, know, soon. Yeah, soon. Come to the East Coast so we can link up. I'm going to come right up there to eat some of them crabs. Eat some of the crab legs? Yeah. He got fried chicken, uh, fried crabs. He got chicken sandwiches now. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's what I saw that he posted. So, but I, like I said, I'll be on the lookout. God willing, I'll be at the fight in um May. Watch you do your thing. When my pay, when my page come back up, hopefully next week we we gonna go on the main page. Yeah, appreciate it. Yeah, we gotta go on the big page for real. See, they be hating. You know what I mean? That's why they do yeah. that. So got to. But one question: Fury versus Joshua. Who you got winning? I like Fury. I just like Fury's boxing skills. I Me think too. he has superior boxing skills and great IQ. Me too. My brother said, even though I'm mad, he beat my boy. He said, um. Do you have any interest in becoming an analyst? You have very good knowledge on the science, on the, on the sport. Who's there to say after I retire? Why not? <laughs> yeah. Nice. You. Thank you. <laughs> Absolutely. All right, DC, I'm going to hit you up, hopefully, uh, by Monday, okay. you know. No, uh, thank you. Appreciate you for having Always. me on. Always. And Always. I need you to unlock the big page so we can go in there and go I crazy. I know. It ain't me, yeah. it's them. <laughs> no. So hopefully next week, all right? I I'll hit okay. you. All right. Thank you.